YouTube video, everybody. Here I am sitting at the embalming table with a package in front of me. What does that mean? Oh, it means it's another unboxing video, ladies and gentlemen. That's right. It has been a while since we've done an unboxing video. And I'm super fucking excited because this is my very first unboxing from a small artisan. And you guys will hear me yell all the time about support local, support small business, all that stuff. And I buy... 99.5 of my stuff from places that are near me or places that I can drive to. Like I very rarely shop online, but if I do shop online, it's because I'm supporting a small artist. I bought art prints off people off Etsy. You know what I mean? From people's small business websites, whatever. So like, if you're going to buy online, support a small artist because it's fucking awesome. You get an awesome product and you're doing a good thing and supporting somebody's like actual life and actual art, which is fucking cool. So, and the other thing I love about small artists, such as Junkyard Bat here, who is the lovely human that sent me this package, is that, like, people see my work online, they see my sewing work, they see the things that I make, whatever, and they say, wow, that's cool. And sometimes they contact me and they want to buy one, right? Like, I've had a few orders from people out there in internet land that have seen my videos and have asked me to make them stuff. And that's always really cool to know that someone appreciates what you do so much that they actually want to order from you, right? So... This, like I said, this lovely human being, Junkyard Bat, sent me a surprise package of things that uh, they've made, and I cannot wait to get into this. And I've also lost my scissors. I don't know why. I don't know where the fuck they've gone, but I have this, like, weird blunt knife. So I'm hoping that it helps us open this package, bubble wrapped with care. Hopefully I don't, like, cut into anything in here. That would be terrible. I've done that before, opening packages. It's bad time. So we're just going to rip this. Oh my god, it's so cute. I can tell already. Things. Okay, that's just Okay, that's just nothing. Perfect. All right. Ooh. So first of all, onk patch right off the bat. That's fucking awesome. That's awesome. And I have an upcoming project which this will be absolutely perfect for fucking love handmade patches especially these weird ones with like the raw canvas edges like punk patches those are great that's the start of like jackets like this right like that's where shit like that comes from very cool onk patch right off the bat really excited about that ah! jesus throwing stuff around okay so we've got three circle tins here uh two of them are crushed to ever living shit so Thank God that they were packaged in tins because the male people are not super gentle with packages, unfortunately. Okay. Let's start with this one. We've got some... Oh, Junkyard Bat stickers! It's white on white. You probably can't see it, but, like, that's cool. I'll show it to you close up when I, when I film this stuff close up. We've got a bat button, which is awesome. Probably going to put it on this jacket as a matter of fact oh there's there maybe you can see the sticker there i'll film that for you in a minute we got some business cards junkyardbat.com you guys that's where you get this awesome shit let's see okay Ooh, it's so pretty ah it's so pretty look at that that is heavy you guys this is amazing You guys know how much I love rosaries, right? Like, I wear them all the time. And this is amazing. I definitely, I definitely don't have one like this. That's so beautiful. That's so beautiful. And it's well made. Like, I do a little bit of jewelry making myself, but, like, not, not like this. That's so pretty. Okay. Tin number one. Tin number two. Now, he had said one of these things was for me, one is for Brody, and one is for Jessica. So I'm going to figure out which is which as I go along here. Another sticker, because we all like stickers. Everybody's getting a sticker. Ooh, the coffin locket. Look at that. Look at it. That's beautiful. That's totally, 
totally, totally beautiful. What a gorgeous coffin. Does it open? Oh my God, it opens. Look, you can keep things in it. Flat things. You can keep flat things in there. That's fucking amazing. That's gorgeous. I'm trying to lay these out nicely. Slanted embalming tables are not the best for displaying jewelry, you guys. I just found this out right now. Okay, that one. We've got one more thing here. Man, look at this. Like, look at how fucking fucked up this tin is. Can you see this? Like, that is really crushed. So, you know, thank God for bubble wrap. Because the mailmen are not careful with things. Especially mine. My mail person is, like, not good. Can I get the lid off of this? Because it's really warped. Oh, good, okay. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, you guys. Twisted somehow. Why are you twisted? Stop being twisted. There we go. Look at this. Fuzz. Fuzz. Look at this absolute absinthe gorgeousness. Like that is, that's incredible. That's like, that's a work of art right there. Oh my God. Thank God that this bad crushed tin didn't like damage this thing because that's so pretty. You might think that this one is for me because you know, Madam Madison, but no, this one is in fact, uh, for Brody. It will match his beautiful green eyes. So let me just film this gorgeousness up close for you. And, uh, then I'm going to round up my gorgeous friends and try on the gorgeous jewelry for you. Hang on one second. All right. First, I'm going to show you these tins. Look at how bad these are. Like that's really, that's really, really bad. That was clearly like bent around a pole. And that makes me mad because I could use these beautiful tins for other stuff. Well, I could have anyways, except that they're totally crushed and fucked up. But anyways, thank God the jewelry made it here safe. That's all that matters. So here we are. Look at this. Look at how, look at how beautiful this is in the glass. Oh, so jealous. That's going to look so beautiful on Brody. So, so beautiful on him. And here's the coffin locket. with The black beads and everything. God, that's pretty. And it opens. See, it's got a little latch here on the side. Opens up. And then here's the rosary chain. Look at this. Is that not gorgeous with the red beads? Thank God I don't have purple hair anymore. Can wear the red beads. I'm going to wear that with something beautiful. I'm so excited. And then here's the stickers. And the button. And the onk patch. And business cards. These are great. I love having business cards from artisans. Yep. There you go. Facebook, Instagram, junkyard bat. That was cool too. I saw that one on his website. That's a beautiful, the bat skull necklace. Oh my God, that's pretty. So there you have it, the gorgeousness that was shipped to me in the mail by Mr. Junkyard Bat. And uh, now it's just time for a fashion montage. I like the best. It's, it's a toss up. They're all equally gorgeous. Like this is incredible. So if you have to buy online, definitely support small artisans, fuck Amazon, get your shit for people that actually make quality stuff. That's going to last. And you're supporting someone's actual like livelihood and life. And that's amazing. So if you like that, 
give this video a thumbs up. If you want to subscribe to my channel, that would be amazing. If you want to follow me on Instagram, I'm under Madame underscore Absinthe for outfit pictures, such as they are. If you want to follow me on Twitter, same thing, Madame underscore Absinthe for pictures of my face, sewing in progress, other random shit on Twitter. If you want to follow me on Facebook, I have Facebook now. I'm Madame Absinthe on Facebook. You got to look it up. It's the one with a picture of my face because it's Facebook. If you want to buy me a Kofi, you can do that. It's Kofi.com slash Madame Absinthe. If you want to support my weird fabric art and the maintenance of my sewing machines, what else? Oh, Depop. I have Depop now. So if you want to buy some of my secondhand jewelry and other shit, that's great. Depop.com slash Madame Absinthe. And I think that's it. Like, subscribe, follow me on social media, ring the bell for notifications, buy me a Kofi if you want to, check out my Depop. Oh, and also check out my TikTok. I make really fucking stupid videos. Few and far between, there's not many on there, but if you want to go have a laugh, check out my TikTok. And that's it. I'll see you guys around for our next fabulous YouTube video, whatever that is. I don't even know. What is it, Jessica? I don't know. Something. Something great. Something great. Stay tuned, folks.